Suppose you've got two shapes which you are told are similar and you want to find some missing sides on these two shapes. Now, first of all I must emphasize these are not drawn to scale nor can we assume they are right angle triangles. They're just sketches. However, when you see the phrase similar shapes, one must think of multiplying and division. Because when shapes are similar, it means that one of them is an enlargement of the other. And we can see by looking at two of the corresponding sides that if we do 15 divided by 5 that triangle 2 is three times as big as triangle 1. So once again 15 divided by 5 equals 3 and this means that all the sides have been enlarged by a factor of 3. So for example, this side here corresponds with the 4. So to find A, we just need to multiply 4 by 3. So A must equal 12. Now the other missing side is B. Now B corresponds to the 21 over here, but to get back to B requires us to reverse the enlargement. So rather than times by 3, as we found A, we must divide by 3 to get back to B. And 21 divided by 3 equals 7. Now, Another extension style question I could ask is suppose you knew the area of one of the triangles. Now there's one key thing to be aware of here. Now unlike the sides where we just times by 3 to find the new side or divided by 3 to reverse the change, with the area we don't just times by 3. And the giveaway really is in the unit, the square in the unit. To find the new area we times by the ratio squared and 3 squared equals 9 so the new area is 72 centimetres squared.